Uh, my experience yesterday was uh, we hooked up uh, quite a few power tools and we kind of got started a little earlier than, uh, than we should have. The sun wasn't out completely yet and uh, my system shut down. Um, usually I can figure it out when it shuts down, it'll time out for a while. Um, but uh, this time the, the voltage was still, uh, it, it timed out, wouldn't turn back on. And uh, the voltage in the battery were reading 49.7, 49.8. So, uh, so I, uh, I checked in the manual that came with the unit, and it, uh, it, it said that it would only time out for a short time if it uh, dropped below 1.9 volts per cell, I believe. So we, we uh, calculated that and knew we didn't do that. So uh, we were at a loss. We kind of took it apart and we could find a cap blown or anything blown, and we didn't. And uh, I thank God Steve uh, uh, put something up on the YouTube channel and uh, got a response. I think... Uh... Uh, there's three fellas that uh, kind of helped me out quite a bit yesterday, and uh, that was off-grid kid. Uh, you had specific things to try, so I can tell that you've got a lot of technical knowledge about it, on-hand stuff. And then also DIY Tesla, I think his name is. Um, I'm, and I, and I'm, I'm going to put the links to their pages here. So if, if you see these or if you see these links up here, check these guys out. DIY Tesla, um, uh, Off Grid Kid, and then uh, my my good friend down in Australia, and just in case. And uh, you three guys, I really want to give y'all kudos. Of course, to everybody that contributed and said, did you try this or try that? Uh, his system's going again now, and back on the good list we're, we're back to loving the pip inverter and thanks to all you guys out there that contributed anything at all and be sure to check out these three guys uh, pages and uh, support them as well they're they're very knowledgeable but once I got everything back up and running I um, had electricity all the way to the transformer but nothing coming out of the transformer and of course I didn't have anything plugged in because I unplugged everything and uh, I questioned Steve about it and he goes, well, yeah, you, you need to put a load through it. So we plugged in the water distiller and the refrigerator and uh, that, that kicked it through the transformer. Glad we're back in shape. Me too. All right. Thanks, thanks. guys. Thanks a lot.